water again. What of you? Let's see what the camera's caught. Right. Let's see who visited our little bit of paradise. Yeah. Let's do the little thing, even though. Yeah. Did you see that frog? No, I missed him. He's right here. Bye-bye, oh. <laughs> froggy. Bye-bye. Good job, Ed. So we have to start our bear bell once we get into the clearing because... Why is that, Ab? There's our round. There's our round. We found the mama bear and the baby bear playing in our field right here. So, this is not too far from our cabin, but we have to keep our bear bells on because they like to play right here. That was the deer. But we also saw the baby bear. Yeah, but they weren't playing. Yeah, he was. The funnel spider's web. So cool. Cool. Mama. Okay, so this is off. Boom. How many batteries does it need? Like eight. Oh my goodness. So bagged batteries are going to be. Here, I'll just take the batteries that are. The good ones? Uh, sure. You'll be good bat. I'll be bad bat. Yeah.
it echoes through here. You know, he told me that there's a, a store that you can hear the Christmas music at Christmas time here. It sounds like it's right around the corner, but it's like three miles away. Really? Yeah. Is it because downtown has music playing out loud outside? Yeah, that's that's what you can hear. Yeah. You can hear the downtown music playing. I heard it when I went for the settlement for the cabin. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> We're not going to say what downtown. Yeah. That way the people who are watching. You doing a little umbrella routine? <laughs> All right, we better hope that that's the only uh, camera that needs batteries. Camera that needs batteries, or we're gonna be out of luck. I hear him. Yeah. All right. Might be yelling at a bear. What the hell? All right, let me get ahead of you guys. I need to be, do I need to be way behind here? No, you can go right behind. Good job. You might not need your umbrella inside the forest. It might be good enough, you know. Might not be too rainy actually inside. The rainforest. The rainforest. Okay, we're on what we call the super highway. This is a trail that pretty much spans the entire length of our property. So far on this camera, we've seen a lot of deer. And a little deer too, a little pink deer. So this trail takes you to our second parcel. This is what a bear bill looks like. Oh, cool, you have your own now? Mm -hmm. How lucky are you? I don't know. Very lucky. Kind of weird. Oh, that's new. Pretty sort of new, right? Yeah. But there's been these big storms here lately. Yeah. And this is a spot that we know a bear was getting some bugs and grubs so maybe something's going on maybe they're building a bear tree house oh, yeah, yeah. that would be a nightmare <laughs> please so we're lucky enough to be able to have another four plus acres this way here that we don't have any cameras set up because it's just so fern covered at the moment. In the fall and the winter, we can definitely get there and put some cameras up, but in the summer, it's just really hard. Oops. What do you see? Deer just went right up that hill over there. Oh boy, we have some deer in the meadow. So this is a little meadow that the previous owners planted some really beautiful ornamental trees and a lot of Japanese honeysuckle. 
and the deer really use this as an area to eat and to also sleep at night. It's in between two ridges. And when there's enough rain, there's a creek that runs through it, or stream rather. A little bit more of a peek into that mystery parcel of ours. The Somebody's been eating. To burst, you can smell them. Yeah, somebody's eaten the most, the lowest ones. Oh my goodness! Look at the um, hummingbird moth. Can you see this moth right here? Yeah. Here, you want to take the camera? Yeah, that moth looks like a hummingbird, but it's beautiful. Butterflies are one of my favorite folks. Here. Moves like a hummingbird, right? Mm -hmm. That's wildflower. Hello, butterfly. Wow, butterflies are brave. How can I handle this? Some humans that are trying to get them. Humans. I don't think any humans are trying to get these guys. Well, like the smallest bee in the world just was gonna get these flowers. Really? Yeah. A baby tiny bee? Yeah. Look at all these great spots where you could you sit barely... down, put down a picnic blanket. Oh, is this poison? Um, no, I don't think so. Turned off the bell because there's no deer around. Yeah, then there's no, there's no bear. No bear. And you'll remember, this is one of the meadows where we caught the big, big black bear walking through. So. Wow. Pretty cool. I'm pretty small. Anyway. Yeah, you're pretty small. It's growing pretty wild. Although we do see the deer eating it a lot. Batteries okay. Batteries are good. What is in that mystery parcel? What goes on up there? I know, right? That's all I want to know. Well, look how wet the umbrella is getting. Oh, oh you gonna drink some rain? Well, it's the water we drink, right? Yeah, you can drink rainwater. <laughs> All right, the next camera is in the magical forest. I think these are marigold. These little sort of very banana variegated, smaller. variegated. Yeah, it's marigold, but I've never seen wild marigold, and I don't see any flowers yet. But it looks very similar. It smells like bananas. <laughs> it smells like bananas. Is that this? Does that smell great? That smell grapes, don't you? Mm hmm. It smells like maybe there's like a. Um, it smells like much in the sun. That's why it's not allowed to drink it. We're thinking that the bears must be hanging out mostly on the mystery parcel because. We just don't see them 
It's the furthest from our house and also from all of our neighbors, so it's probably the most quiet spot. And we do see a lot of deer hanging out everywhere else. We don't think the deer would be sleeping that close to the bears. So as you can see, we're getting back into our other piece of land. This is the property line here. And above us is a sneak peek of the magical forest. It's where the tallest trees on our property are. It also goes all the way up to the top of the ridge. It's quite steep. Get up, right? Yep, exactly. Oh man, remember when I scared that fawn accidentally away? Yeah. That's okay. Want to do up? <laughs> All right, and we kind of have to go down immediately back to the super highway and head to Autos. Yeah. All right, so let's go. I think we can go down over here, right, Lonnie? Yep.
But we both have heard bears over here. These must be bear footprints. Black walnut? Hmm. As you can see, we're above our cabin now. So we've heard some large animals coming through Lemon. the forest Lemon. here. Lemon. I think it's a black walnut, baby. It does look like a lemon. Look, they sound cute. Can we bring that one home? They stain your hands. Yeah, Daddy knows from experience. You must be near a tree, there's a lot of them. Sorry, Mom, you were saying a, lo a, lo a large animal. Yeah, we've heard large animal Look. running through the forest here, so. Could that be? Well, somebody's doing some landscaping. Another black walnut. Two black ones. Over here. So many walnuts. Golly gee. Sit up. Is there a horse fruit coming around? I don't think they're feeling well. I think there's enough human noise today with all the landscaping we hear our neighbors doing. Yeah, my only concern is that they're so far away they're driving to you in this direction. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, our goal is not to use the bear spray. <laughs> Just hoping to have everybody enjoy the land without any trouble. All right, this is a big trek, guys. It's very steep. There she goes. Somehow daddy can run it. <laughs> we need to take a break, right girls? <laughs> it's okay, each time you do it, you get stronger, right? Really? Yeah. Exactly. Can you feel yourself getting stronger? Yeah. Oh, that's medicine. So I was looking. You can go past me. Good job. This, this road? Yeah. This has been a demarcation between farmland and forest forever. So like all of this is new growth, all of that's old growth. Oh, interesting. Who wins? Let's see. Oh, Abigail. Good job. How far? Beer chewing or bear chewing? Beaver. <laughs> Sorry. Who's the 
porcupine up on this trail. They eat some interesting things. They eat bones. Fail army. This is always a very interesting raft. It's more safe person than spider webs, so nothing six foot five is coming through here. <laughs> Sounds like the rain's getting worse. Yeah. All right. I fail it to the On your mark. <laughs> <laughs>